Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel. Today we want to look at bar fights. You know, bar fights tend to get nasty when people start to use the glass ashtrays. You can now usually find them outside of bars anyway, but these are hard and um, very heavy. And of course you can also throw them and then they can do a lot of damage. I want to make a slingshot that fires glass ashtrays. <laughs> and here it is. I call it the bar fight dominator. Let me explain its features to you. So first you see that it has a bayonet attachment where you can put in a broken off long bottle, beer bottle. And um, it's attached with rubber of course. It's a mighty stabbing weapon that way. It has a magazine for a total of four ashtrays plus one in the chamber. And how you load it is very simple. You simply slide in the ashtrays until it's full, like this. And then you close it so they don't fall out. So you need very strong bands to shoot them properly. And in order to be able to do this, I have this chest plate where I can simply grab these levers, pull back until it's cocked and an asteroid is in the chamber. And now I can simply shoot. It's a repeating weapon, so I can fire one shot after the next. And it's pretty accurate. So let's look at the kind of damage this thing can cause. That's gonna be fun. We will test this melon first. Achtung, fertig. <laughs> so now ashtray versus grapefruit. Achtung, fertig. <laughs> that would have been a pretty painful hit, I guess. And now, of course, coconut time. Yeah. Achtung, fertig. <laughs> Achtung, fertig. Let's test the bayonet against the grapefruit. Oops. <laughs> Seems like it works. So when you are in a bar and someone comes in with this, then better leave him alone. <laughs> if you want to see some more secret photos also of the inside of the gun, then come to my forum. You will find the link in the text description. That's it for today. I hope you liked it. Thanks and bye bye.